We're here at the uh, GCSE ASNA2 2016 Caxton Young Artists Exhibition. In the exhibition you'll find work of a variety of different materials, a variety of different outcomes, but all are based on the same assessment objectives, which is to develop work, review and refine, and look at artists and learn from them. The journey before the final piece is more important than the final piece itself. That's where 75% of the marks are. The final piece is the conclusion, and we hope it's an individual conclusion because we encourage each pupil to work in their own way. For the final piece, I decided to base it from my home, Bermuda. I've taken a realistic photo and I've tried to transform it into different artist styles. I went from minimal to a bit of in-between, like a mixture of minimal and art. It's quite difficult at times because there's a lot of pressure for good quality work. You have lots of deadlines. Um, you have to make sure that the work is actually up to standard. You think that you can do a bunch of work, but it has to have a link. You have to have a journey through your art. You can start off doing flowers and end up doing rocket ships. It's all about the development and it's pretty hard. Everyone thinks art's quite easy, but it's not at times. People take it as an easy way out, but it's actually one of my challenging subjects. Es que estoy bastante sorprendido porque el, el nivel lo veo para ser alumnos que no son alumnos de, de bellas artes, que todavía no, no tienen esa vocación marcada. Me parece un buen, muy buen nivel. Cuando no hay imposiciones por parte del, 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 del profesorado, el alumno saca su verdadera personalidad sin cortapisas. Eso me está apareciendo aquí. Primero porque cada uno está expresando, está expresando su propia personalidad. Sin cortapisas. Claro que le va a servir. Le va a servir a que se relacione sin ningún miedo. Porque son capaces de hacer, de, de, de proyectar su personalidad sin ningún miedo. Y eso en su vida futura como, no sé, científicos o matemáticos o lo que sea, les va a servir muchísimo. Van a, van a afrontar la vida sin miedos, con absoluta objetividad personal, que eso es importante.